This afternoon, the union representing American Airlines pilots delayed a vote on a measure that would boost pay and vacation benefits for some of their members. Our Jack Fink, live at the Pilots Union headquarters in Fort Worth. Jack? Well, Kaylee, the Allied Pilots Association will now vote on this pay scale issue January 16th. And some formerly furloughed pilots told me off camera today they want this approved because this has gone unresolved for a while now. The original founder. It was something that kind of fell victim to the bankruptcy. For years, these and 2,000 other American Airlines pilots, once furloughed after 9 11, have waited to have their pay scale adjusted to the industry standards. Today, they hope leaders of their pilots' union, the Allied Pilots Association, would have approved a deal hashed out with Americans' executives last month to do just that. But a spokesman says union leaders want more time to study the issue. The association says American Airlines came to an agreement on this issue after pilots agreed to help fix a scheduling error by the airline that could have led to 10,000 flights being canceled during the holidays. It led to some upper level talks between our leadership and uh, the senior executives at American Airlines. So if union leaders approve later this month, Americans once furloughed pilots will see their pay scale and vacations increased to similar levels for pilots at Delta and United. Most of the pilots who were furloughed after 9-11 come, come back at uh, relatively junior on the pay scale, so say third year pay, fourth year pay, length of service credit would give them the ability to come back at 10, 11, 12 year pay. And the spokesman says the association is also considering making improvements to the pilot's work rules. Live in Fort Worth tonight, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.